Hi, Zach Pater here at River Valley Marine in Red Wing, Minnesota. What a beautiful boat to take you through today. This here is an 06 Sea Ray, 290 Sundancer. Absolutely gorgeous boat. This thing is loaded too. It's got air heat generator, twin 4.3 multi-ports, windless anchor, very nice full canvas enclosure. Take a look at the outside of the boat. It is in very good shape. Probably be hard to see on video, but it's just a very shiny boat. Good looking setup. Nice big bow rails across the front of the boat. Big flat decks on the 290. They did a great job with that. Again, your windless anchor, nice stainless cleats. Does have a walk-through windshield, which makes it nice for getting up to the bow. And you'll see that arch design is pretty cool because you don't have a forward bimini and there's a grab handle up there as well. So let's take a closer look at the inside of the boat. Take a walk into the cockpit here, but first take a look at this big swim platform. They do a great job. You do have a ski tow eye down there, so if you want to pull the kids on a tube or something like that. Nice big stainless cleats uh, below on the platform and up on the side of the boat, so convenient for hanging fenders off the side. There is a transom trunk in the back, and that's where your shore power runs through. Nice big entry going into the boat. One level, there is a door, and right here on the back you actually have a transom shower as well. Step inside the uh, 290 cockpit area, it's nice and open. You got a generous sized wood table there. Over here to the port side, there's uh, companion seating. All the seats, and again, it'll be hard to see in video, are in what I would say very, very nice condition. The stitching um, is all solid, no rips and tears or anything to that effect. Uh, over here to the starboard side, you do have a wet bar. There's storage underneath, great place for a cooler. Work our way forward, again, the uh, steps to go through to the walkthrough windshield. Attractive looking dash there. You have the Ray Marine setup. Good looking set of gauges, your controls, tilt wheel, and it does have the flip up bolster for the helm seat. Simply flip it up and you got plenty of legroom. You'll notice down right below the shifters are your start and stops. It's conveniently located, but yet out of the way so they accidentally don't get bumped. Stereo controls, just a really cool setup. So let's take a look in the cabin. Work our way down below, and it's very nice and it's very open. There's a lot of headroom inside. The woodwork is very well done. Ceres always done a good job with their fit and finish. The 290 has the uh, full bed in the front. You also have the port side seating. And you'll notice there is storage everywhere. Nice pop-out buttons to open everything up. All vinyl headliner, and you'll see they have the covers for the uh, windows up above. Nice size bed, TV with DVD player, your microwave, solid surface tops, refrigerator, air conditioning controls, very convenient. Uh, work our way to the back of the boat, and you've got your mid cabin. It's a nice size mid cabin for a 29 foot boat. It'll be hard to see in video here, but it is very, very sharp looking. And then off here to the starboard side is the head. That head compartment is all fiberglass lined, stainless steel sink. You got vacuum flush head, some storage up above, a mirror, and then on the back side of the door is actually a full size mirror as well. So that there is a real quick video walk around to this 290 Series Sundancer, a boat that cosmetically and mechanically should not disappoint. Again, I'm Zach Pater here at River Valley Marine, River Valley Power and Sport in Red Wing, Minnesota. I appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. Please call, text, or email with any questions or to set up a time to view.